have every function of the sort, along with the roasting and poking fun at the honored guest, of course. You must have at least one person on the days who can bring a little sobriety. A bit of distinction to the occasion. Someone whose soft-spoken manner and delicate delivery is the very essence of humility and gentleness. Don Rickles is a man who will go down in history with such names as Heinrich Himmler, <laughs> Attila the Hun. In truth, Don is one of the most well-loved guys in our business. The only time you really feel insulted by him is when he doesn't insult you. Don't worry, Johnny. Tonight you will not be deprived. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Mr. Warm, <laughs> Don Riggles! Oh, I would like to say, first off, that this evening is one of the big, bomb, dull evenings of my life. <laughs> I'd like to welcome the honored mayor. Good to see you, sir. Having a good time while the city is being destroyed. <laughs> what can he do to me? He's not Jewish. <laughs> I'm only kidding you, mayor. I never met you. Make a note of that. <laughs> <laughs> Once in a while, they'd move your body or they're going to throw dirt on you. <laughs> it's a great treat to have Ed Sullivan being wheeled in here to be with you tonight. <laughs> Johnny, I'd like to say from the bottom of my heart, nobody likes you. Johnny. <laughs> You're a vicious guy. Hope you go back to Nebraska and get a fungus all over your body. What do you mean? His mother was supposed to be here tonight, but the pickup broke down. She's out on the highway with his father going, Oh, Johnny loves us! <laughs> Isn't this fun, Ed? You're staying up late? <laughs> Later on, you're going to watch Johnny take a shower. I see you in the shower. <laughs> the water runs up. <laughs> the water runs up. That's right. What am I, Johnny Belinda? <laughs> this is too fast, Mayor. <laughs> I'm only kidding, Mayor. <laughs> Get rid of the Mayor, Ed. <laughs> One of your bears roll all the way. I knew a big star would wear a clip-on bow tie. <laughs> Johnny has been a friend of mine for a lot of years. I've been out with you very, very, quite a few times in California. And I want to say publicly, he's definitely cheap. Um, <laughs> the last time this man went to his wallet, Chester Morris' picture moved. <laughs> That's his lovely wife. <laughs> I get you, Joanne. You're a wonderful girl. Remember the old days when you did night train? <laughs> She's a wonderful girl. <laughs> Ever since the bowl blew out, you couldn't do the number. <laughs> I get Joanne for one reason, because I never liked her either. <laughs> and good luck to the Italian barber. Can I see your papers? <laughs> Plus, Ed McMahon, good luck to you, wino. <laughs> and Steve, as a friend, that suit went out of style about eight years ago. <laughs> I'll be off in a minute, Mayor, and you can find out if you're still the mayor. I do want to say, though... <laughs> Will the band come out from behind the linen? <laughs> good, good to see you guys. That's Kate Kaiser's old band. They passed away in the back. <laughs> 
it's a, it's a big kick. Isn't this fun, Ed? Huh? <laughs> Try to move your gums, see if the teeth are working. <laughs> and he's sitting there going, where's the apes? Anyway, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that a good one, huh, John? How does it feel to hear laughter instead of sitting up there at 12 o'clock at night interviewing Hunts Hall? <laughs> what I'm saying, to all of you, I, I kid you, Johnny, and the Honorable Mayor, I say this in jest, sir, not that I have to apologize because you're a wonderful man. Remember backstage when you came over to me and said, I'm the mayor. <laughs> <laughs> and they're all sitting here drinking. <laughs> I always say in my humor, it is delightful when you kid big people. The mayor is a very prominent man. Everyone on the stage is prominent. My whole life, my dad rest his soul, he told me, Don, if you laugh at authority and you try to do it with dignity, uh, it is fun. Uh, Johnny Carson, as Alan King mentioned, gave me my start on television uh, with the late night shows, and I'm very grateful to him. I kid about him, I flew here from California in his honor, not that I should win a medal for that, but it is nice to know that someone is that important to you, that you can take time out from your career to pay respect to a guy that gives his all, and when he believes in you, he certainly goes all the way. Mr. Carson has done everything in his power to further my career. I am forever grateful on behalf of my wife and my little baby girl, Mindy Beth, and my mother in Miami. You are a good man. <laughs> I always say that because she's in the will. <laughs> But to you, John, really, may God be good to you, and I wish you what I have, people that care, and you certainly do have that. Bless you. Thank you.